to remove or to insert an element into an array. Before we insert, we need to remove one of the names out of our list. Okay, so we have an array size 10 with 10 names in. I amount is set to 10. When we click on the delete button to the remove or delete, it will remove one of the names out of the array and then decrease I amount by one um, because then there will only be nine names left in the list. Okay. But when we click on insert, um, we click on insert, uh, we're going to say I amount is which is equals to nine down to let's say the value spin edit is two. So we're going to say I amount is equals to I, so I is nine. So it's going to take the ninth one in the list, which is Jack, and it's going to copy and paste it and put it into the last one. So it's going to be in amount 10. Then it's going to go down to, so I amount, or I will decrease by once, and then it's 8. So then it will take the 8th name and copy that into the ninth position. Then down to, we'll decrease I by one again, and it will continue like this until, I'm just going to undo this, until you reach the value of where the new name must be inserted. Okay, so it was number two, so it will continue until you reach number two, and then you're going to take whatever, then the for loop will end, then you're going to take the new name that was asked to be inserted and you're going to add that to the position of the array names so you're going to add that to that position so it's going to move basically move everything up to the right to make space for that name and then we are going to insert it and then we must also increase the amount by one again because there will be a new name in this array so the i amount needs to be increased by one then i'm going to call the form create and it's going to clear the rich edit and it's going to display everything again in the rich edit.